What's up, Bay Area? I'm Jonathan Bloom here with your Thursday local athlete tracker from the Tokyo Olympics. And right now, the hottest place in Tokyo is the beach. They are the A-team in every sense of the word. And now Alex and April are headed to the gold medal match. They won the semifinals against Switzerland in just over 45 minutes on a sweltering day with the sand reaching 111 degrees Fahrenheit. Turns out they've been training for this, practicing in Orlando to get used to the heat and humidity. The Bay Area's own Stanford grad Alex Kleinman will play for gold in primetime Thursday at 7.30 p.m. on NBC. Also headed to the gold medal game, men's basketball. The Warriors Draymond Green and Oakland native Damian Lillard on the team that came from behind to beat the Australians 97 to 78. This game was closer than the score. Team USA was trailing for the whole first half, but they came back in the third quarter with Kevin Durant leading the way. And though he's not a Warrior anymore, Warriors coach Steve Kerr, who's there as assistant coach in Tokyo, has plenty to say about KD. He's the most talented basketball player on earth. Uh, if not of all time. You played with Michael Jordan and, and, and I know, KD's. I know. Is right I there. think he's more gifted. I really do. I mean, 6'11 with guard skills, unlimited three point range. Kevin is a different, entirely uh, different breed. It's just stunning. Women's indoor volleyball is inching closer to the medal matches with Bay Area three time Olympian Faluka Akinrodawo Gunderson on the team. You know, she took a year off from volleyball in 2019 to have her first child, and her road back to the Olympics turned out to be challenging, but also inspiring. I was eight weeks pregnant um, when we won the championship. I had my son in November of 2019, developed diastasis from that. It was like a hole in my stomach. Not feeling any core power doesn't work well for volleyball. Just the strength of the female body, like what we're able to endure and how our body changes and how we're able to adapt in a new way is really impressive. And talking about cool moms, how about the most epic kind of soccer mom, a mom who plays soccer in the Olympics? Alex Morgan, who went to UC Berkeley, one of six Bay Area players on the team competing for the bronze medal in the middle of the night against Australia. The replay at 10.30 p.m. on NBC Sportsnet. Morgan said she's been missing her daughter during these Olympics. One thing she's grateful for, USA Soccer pays for nannies whenever the players travel. I do feel supported, which helps me just be able to focus on playing soccer like when I step on the field. I feel like nowadays, you know, we're able to embrace being a mom and being a working mom. Also playing overnight, the U.S. baseball team, including two Bay Area players, in the semifinals against South Korea. You can watch the replay on NBCOlympics.com. Women's water polo took on the Russians in semifinals late Wednesday night with these three Bay Area athletes leading the way. And yes, all three of them scored goals in this game. The Russians controlled the first half, but Team USA pulled ahead to win 15 to 11. Now they get some well-deserved rest as they prepare for the gold medal game on Saturday. Meanwhile, the men had a day off before they play Italy Friday morning, hoping to keep their gold medal dreams alive. This is the first trip to the Olympics for Cal graduate Johnny Hooper. He's been in sports his whole life and always wanted to win that next big thing. Right now, this is it. You know, I'm living in the present. I want to win if it's a 12 and under championship. Okay, I want to win that. I want to win a high school division one championship. Okay, did that. I want to win a college division one national championship. Okay, did that. All right, what's the next thing? Let's go get a, a gold medal at the Olympics. It is down to the wire and the excitement is building. Check out our local athlete tracker blog for all the latest results as the Bay Area quest for Olympic glory reaches a fever pitch in Tokyo.